The theory of change process was a multi-day process. One, one day, uh, one of the questions he was asking was, you know, so what age group do you want to serve? The organization that I was leading at the time was basically birth to death, doing this, that, and the other thing with uh, every, everywhere from infants all the way up through senior citizens. And, and one of the issues with that is that you can't, you can't focus. Uh, you know, you're doing everything and you can't do anything well. And so we had to have this age conversation. I remember this even though it was 12 years ago, like it was yesterday. Because the, the, the conversation, there were people all around the room saying, well, you know, if, if we just serve 14-year-old, 14, 14 to 24-year-olds, what about those, those young people that are uh, uh, sixth graders going into seventh grade? We really need to go down to 12. And then somebody else said, well, you know, there's, if you can't read by eight, grade three, then, you know, you're, you're in trouble. So why don't we, why don't we go down to nine, year, nine and 10-year-olds? And then somebody else said, it's really all about early childhood education. And before you know it, we're all the way down to, to three and four-year-olds. And I, I let the conversation proceed until it got to a point where I said, you know, I, I'm hearing what everybody's saying. Uh, and I just want to say that, you know, you may decide that this is what you want to do as a part of this organization. But it is not my interest. What I really was tired of is trying to do everything for everybody. I thought that we really needed to focus the age. And, and that was a seminal moment because ultimately, you know, in terms of putting that line in the sand, uh, you know, we decided that we were only going to serve 14 to 24 year olds. And now, a little over 12 years after that original decision, and the organization remains firmly focused on 14 to 24 year olds. It has not wavered. And now we're serving more young people over 1600. 100% of our resources are aimed at this population and figuring out how to help them be successful and become economically independent. So it, it was a key decision over 12 years ago that has helped to change not only the trajectory of the organization, but the trajectory of thousands of young people that we've worked with. I think it's fundamental to the focus of the organization and what we've been able to do in terms of getting more young people to our three key outcomes, high school graduation, post-secondary credential, and meaningful employment.